Hello and welcome back to our weekly roundup of the latest news and drama in the world of motorsport. From Formula One to Rally, we've got all the latest updates from the track. Let's get started. Mercedes has dominated Formula One for the past several years, but this season they are facing a new challenger in Red Bull Racing. The two teams have been neck and neck in the opening races of the season, with Red Bull's Max Verstappen currently leading the Drivers' Championship. However, there's been some controversy surrounding the team's rivalry. At the British Grand Prix, Verstappen was involved in a collision with Mercedes driver Lewis Hamilton that sent Verstappen crashing out of the race. The incident has sparked a heated debate among fans and experts about who was at fault. Some have accused Hamilton of being too aggressive, while others argue that Verstappen should have given Hamilton more space. Either way, the incident has added even more drama to an already intense rivalry between the two teams. The MotoGP Championship is also heating up, with defending champion Joan Mir facing stiff competition from Yamaha riders Fabio Quartararo and Maverick Vinales. Quartararo has been particularly impressive this season, winning three races in the opening rounds of the championship. However, there's been some drama off the track as well. Yamaha has been accused of using an illegal device to improve the performance of their bikes. The device, known as a whole shot device, helps riders get a better start by lowering the front of the bike. The device is currently banned in MotoGP, but Yamaha has denied any wrongdoing. The controversy has sparked a lot of debate among fans and experts, with some arguing that Yamaha should be punished if they're found to have used the device illegally. It remains to be seen how the situation will play out, but it's clear that the drama off the track is just as intense as the racing itself. Endurance racing is known for its grueling races that can last for up to 24 hours. The World Endurance Championship WEC is the premier endurance racing series, featuring teams from around the world competing in races that range from 6 to 24 hours in length. Toyota has been the dominant force in the championship in recent years, but they face tough competition at the 24 Hours of Le Mans. The race, which is one of the most prestigious events in motorsport, saw Toyota's lead car suffer a puncture with just a few hours to go. The incident allowed their main rivals, the Glickenhaus team, to take the lead and eventually win the race. The result was a major upset for Toyota, who had been the favorites to win the race. It also sets up an exciting battle for the rest of the season, with Glickenhaus looking to challenge Toyota for the championship. Rally is a form of motorsport that takes place on closed roads, with drivers competing against the clock to complete a series of stages in the shortest time possible. The World Rally Championship WRC is the premier rally championship, featuring events around the world on a variety of surfaces. This season, the championship is shaping up to be a battle between Toyota and Hyundai. Toyota driver Sebastian Aguirre is currently leading the championship, but he's facing stiff competition from Hyundai's Thierry Neuville and Art Tanak. However, there's been some controversy surrounding the championship as well. The WRC recently announced that they would be implementing a new rule that limits the number of test days. In other news and drama in the automotive industry, electric vehicles EV have been gaining popularity in recent years as more consumers look for eco-friendly alternatives to traditional gasoline-powered cars. However, the EV industry is facing a major challenge, a global shortage of semiconductors. Semiconductors are essential components in the production of EV, but the shortage has caused production delays and forced automakers to reduce output. This has had a ripple effect throughout the industry, with some consumers facing longer wait times for their EV. Despite the challenges, the EV industry is continuing to grow. Major automakers like Ford, General Motors and Volkswagen are investing billions of dollars in EV production, and new EV startups like Rivian and Lucid Motors are entering the market as well. 
The automotive industry has been rocked by several scandals in recent years, including the emissions cheating scandal that involved Volkswagen and the Takatan airbag scandal that affected millions of vehicles worldwide. More recently, General Motors has been facing criticism over its handling of a defect in its Chevy Bolt EV. The defect has caused several battery fires, prompting a recall of all Bolt EV produced between 2017 and 2022. The recall has been costly for GM, with the company estimating that it will spend over $1 billion to replace the defective batteries. The incident has also damaged GM reputation, as some customers and experts have criticized the company for not acting quickly enough to address the issue. Autonomous vehicles AV are seen by many as the future of transportation, but the industry is still facing several challenges. One of the biggest challenges is ensuring the safety of AV on the road. There have been several high-profile accidents involving AV in recent years, including a fatal crash involving a Tesla vehicle in 2018. The incident raised questions about the safety of Tesla's autopilot system, which is designed to assist drivers with steering, acceleration, and braking. Despite the challenges, the AV industry is continuing to make progress. Several companies, including Waymo and Cruise, are testing AV on public roads, and some experts predict that AV could become widespread within the next decade. Car culture has been a major part of the automotive industry for decades, with enthusiasts gathering at car shows, races, and other events to celebrate their love of cars. However, the COVID-19 pandemic has forced many events to be canceled or postponed, causing disappointment among car enthusiasts. However, the industry is starting to recover, with car shows and events beginning to return. One of the most highly anticipated events is the 2021 SEMA Show, which will take place in Las Vegas in November. The event is expected to draw thousands of car enthusiasts and industry professionals from around the world. Despite the challenges of the past year, the automotive industry is continuing to innovate and evolve. From EV to AV, the industry is shaping the future of transportation and changing the way we think about cars. For more motorsport content, follow Avanti Motorsport on YouTube and Instagram now.